passage of time a mysterious concept. It, it doesn't seem like it was that long ago where we were saying there were six days left until this whole final broadcast, final destination as I like to call it, because I'm edgy like that. But guys, now we are only two days away from that bitch. I don't know about you, but to me, that concept is just insane. The fact that we're getting closer and it's going to happen eventually. We don't know right now, but it's gonna fucking happen. But we ain't, we ain't here to get philosophical, though. We here to get hype, my boys, and that's exactly what we are going to do today. And we have one of the best people for that with us. Now, of course, as usual with the guests that appear on the Final Destination series, this motherfucker don't need no intro. He don't need an intro. Nah. He's my boy. Um, he, he might be known to you as one of the great Smash Prophets. This man has done incredible work over the course of time. He has an amazing series going on in his channel right now. Know your moves. You already know who the hell I'm talking about. And like I mentioned, on top of everything else, he's my boy. We got motherfucking Relax Alax in the goddamn building. What's going on, Yo, man? Yo, what's good, Erica? Thank you hey, for having me. What's good? Dude, is this like the first time you appeared on my channel? Cause I, I, think, I, think... I think I did, but it was, I was in a webcam, so... Oh, okay. So, yo, man, you're able to... But then you showed your face on your own channel, too, yeah, yeah, at some point I've, before. Yeah, so I mean... Recently. All right, yeah, so you should all be familiar, man. Yeah. But, but, yo, dude, two days, man. Like, to me, that sounds a little too close for comfort yeah, man. now, man. I'm not ready. It's gonna... It's what, is, the last day is just gonna take forever. Well, maybe this this, I'm gonna be, like, trying to waste... Blow some time, like, editing and crap, but... <laughs> yeah, but I know, man. Hopefully, it's, be so hopefully tense. it's not gonna take too long. But, so, yeah. So you just want to get down to it, like for you, it's hmm. not it's not moving fast enough. Yeah, I just want to I want to know, like I, thinking oh, about man. it, I think about it too long. Like I, I don't know. You you can retain your hype. I don't have the hype stamina, so like I, I, <laughs> I don't have He's the gonna, hype stamina. Yo, I mean, you're like, gonna have a heart after, a hype attack. Yo. After that, like the super leak that happened before launch, it's just like I'm just like. Oh shit! Oh, I know. Yeah, the anxiety. Like, you, you're worried. Like, yo, no leaks. And I agree with yeah, you, dude. I, do I mean, not want to leak because, like, if because, like, right now, I like, there's all the characters we already like. I, I'm, I'm perfectly happy with all the characters we have. I'm like, yo, this is like insane. Anything else, just like, I can't handle it. Like, it's too anything much. Anything else is a dream for it's me. Too much. Like, Banjo Kazooie, Paper Mario. I, if. Whew. And Banjo's chances are looking pretty damn solid yeah. right now. I'm not even gonna think about it. I don't want to like, like oh, curse it. You know, I'm just seriously. Yeah. No, we should call that like we should key that term like like you know how you said like you you, you didn't want to think about it too much you have a hype attack yo like a, like a heart attack now you are gonna have a hype attack man no, hype attack. damn so for you it's not coming fast enough for me it's happening too damn fast yo like all of a sudden like because you know I, I I basically stay at home all the time. I do this full time, so it's like, you know, I don't really leave the house too much. So I'm just waking up in the morning, I sit here all day, I go to sleep, not too much happens. So like, to me, the days are just bam, bam, bam. Yeah. And it's like, God damn, it's too fast, man. I'm not prepared, bro. Like, God damn. I mean, like, I feel I, it's going to happen eventually. It's going to happen eventually. Mm -hmm. Just, I don't know, for me, yeah, not, I, not soon enough. I guess whew. when it does happen, I'll be like, man, wherever we come. Because it was just last year, and so much shit has happened since the launch of, like, both games. Like, so much has happened. Like, I can't believe that, like, it's been a year since, like, I remember just before we were speculating what the roster would look like. I remember, like, on Smash Bros, that's what I did. I, like, I made pretend rosters, like, oh, this is gonna be in, like, Krom's gonna be here, Wolf. Nope. Oh, my God, dude. No, though, though, but, but I mean, well, at this point, I think Wolf still has a very yeah, solid chance. Yeah, Wolf, Wolf definitely has but, a chance. But I guess you want to get into that, like, who we're gonna be thinking about. Yeah, exactly. Like, who, because you mean, I, I, I know for a fact, everyone else knows probably too, that, you know, you had an amazing role going on when it came to predicting what characters would show up. And I know you explained how, what the logic was and everything. Like, holy shit, dude. So, I mean, I know everyone here is curious as fuck. What the hell do you think is going to happen? Yo, bro? okay. What do you think? Okay, I, I made a video like yesterday, but like I do my weekly vlog series and I'm just like. The Smash, um, Smash and Relax. Yeah. So, like, this week I did Smash Wii U and I just talked about what the, my predictions were. Because people have been asking me and like, okay, what do you think, Alex? Because mm. you've got a lot, you've got a pretty good amount of characters right, except like Ridley. <laughs> but I mean, yeah, but yeah. <laughs> it takes it took Sakurai coming out and directly Same. deconfirming him for that to go down. So I mean, I feel like we should be proud about exactly. that at least. So, you know? <laughs> but um, so I I was talking about it. Uh, I think Wolf. Wolf, if there's no wolf, I'm gonna be lost. And yeah, Inkling, that's... like those are my safe predictions. But like yeah, I said it yesterday, like we're at a point where anything can happen. Like cloud happened, no, just all bets are off the table. Like what could you really like predict? I'm thinking, I'm thinking Sakurai's gonna pull all the stops because 
what if he thinks this is his last one? A recent interview, actually, that was translated by Source Gaming, they, uh, he was saying something about, oh, this, is this your last one? He's like, I don't know, I say that every time. Or the interviewer oh, was saying Lord. that. Do you say that every time, Sakurai? But if it might be his last one, this is the last broadcast. That's what they've been hyping it up as. Yeah. I think maybe he's going to pull all the stops. Because he's like, you know what? I'm going to go yeah, out with a bang. If someone, if they're going to remember Masahiro Sakurai, they're going to remember <laughs> Masahiro fucking Sakurai. Yo, this is a legacy right here. This is a legacy, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that's the bucket it. of all the characters. <laughs> that's it, bro. That's why I'm. That's what I'm saying, that's what I'm man. Thinking, like any because and Cloud was the precursor. Yeah. He was the precursor. Like, how can you top that? Like, if Cloud was this, like this uh, broadcast, I don't. Then yeah, it would make sense. But Cloud, how are you going to top Cloud? It's either they don't top him or they do. But I don't. I don't think Sakurai won't. Yeah, I know. I mean, I. Of course, you know that comes to the whole thing of expectations and them being too high. Like, I mean, yeah. everyone obviously seeing the seeing the way that Cloud came out first, and then the direct is going to happen, which is going to be the last one. We're all thinking, okay, something bigger than Cloud. But even if we didn't get something bigger than him, um, I wouldn't be disappointed at this point. Yeah. You know, like Cloud is major in my eyes, and I mean, not just significant for the character that he is, but for everything he represents. Yeah. And on top of everything, the opportunities he represents for the other characters to be in the game. Um, another article that Source Gaming had put out um, recently mentioned that, you know, Sakurai did say that this would pretty much be the end of the DLC. Yeah. Like, you know, like, okay, this is basically going to be it. This is the final hurrah. We know that for a fact. Um, he never specifically said anywhere that he's going to reveal the biggest things with this. But, I mean, it's Sakurai yeah. at the end of the day. That's Daddy Sakurai. We know what this man's this is capable the final, of. The final countdown. Yo, dude. <laughs> Watch me use that for the intro. Of this <laughs> Holy crap. Wait, okay, so you said your safe predictions. You got the Inklings and you got Wolf. I think if Wolf doesn't make it back, dude, I'm seriously going to shed a yeah, tear because like, I feel like he, fuck? like I mean, in terms of like clone characters, which I don't even really feel like he's a real clone to be honest with you. I mean, his moves kind of take on maybe yeah. a slight format. Thing is with, but um, I mean, Wolf, it would probably follow the same like the same idea that Roy and Lucas did because they're both they have similar skeletons to characters already in Smash Four, so they were probably less man work to be put into them rather than making new models. Inkling, maybe, but we don't know for sure. Wolf would follow the same thing, where he could just take from Fox and Falco. Yeah. But, I mean, you know, his moves still had some nice deviation to them. Yeah, I mean, that's what I liked it, about them. I mean, it would just hurt so bad to see, you know, characters, vets, like, um, vet clones like Dr. Mario mm -hmm. uh, make an appearance in Roy, but then not see Wolf, I mean, an antagonist, which Smash Brothers is already lacking in as it is. Yeah. Um, but okay, so... You had your safe bets, man. But now, you know, I want to see, I want to see the the wild side, man. Where's the wild relax, right. man? What the hell do you think? Bro? All right, so because I mean, we ain't safe here on the EWN. We don't well, need protection, if man. Sakurai's <laughs> like, okay, I want to freaking reformulate the Smash family. Freaking Snake <laughs> is back. Ice climbers. Holy However, shit. that happens. Ice climbers Holy gonna shit. happen. Oh my so god. Are you? Do you want ice climbers? Yeah, I do. Actually. Oh, really? okay. All right. Not, Damn. Actually, yo, since since. Yeah, next Know Your Moves, we'll get into that. Let's just say. Oh, shit. Anyways, you got a preview. Ice Climbers, Snake, then these new these new characters. But that's where I, I can't even predict. Like Banjo-Kazooie, Paper Mario, K. Rule. Like, that's where I have no idea. It's just like, that's what I like. Because usually I can predict it. This, like, I have no, no bearing. Damn, man. So as soon as you saw Cloud that day, like, what the hell went through your head? Like, the first thought, as soon as you saw him. Okay, so I don't know if you saw on Twitter, but I was just like, Cloud? <laughs> it, was, it was like a genuine shock, but also like, oh, okay, whatever. Like, what? Yeah, like, <laughs> it's kind of confusing. Because, like, for me, Ryu was the tip of the iceberg, but I guess not oh, because, really? like, you know, like, yeah, we got, for it, me, like, Mega Man, I'm like, oh my god, this is a dream come true. Then Pac Man, I'm like, oh my god, another dream come true. Ryu, I'm like, okay, yo, my hype, my hype attack. I'm, I'm, like, <laughs> I'm like, I'm already exhausted, I'm already in my deathbed. I'm like, it's, I'm, I can't. <laughs> Fading away, he's like, "What, God?" Oh. <laughs> and then, God damn, and man! Like, it, so uh, I have no idea. What do you think? Cause, dude, uh, uh, oh man, I mean, you know, like over here, my my ideas are a little bit more <laughs> edgy, if we could say that much. Um, yeah, yeah, basically the, the edge. <laughs> ah. But I mean, in <laughs> in terms of who I believe now, I mean. We haven't mentioned, you know, the, the polls, the fan polls that have been done yet, and Alpha Rad actually had a solid point when saying that, you know, maybe these indie characters that are being hyped up a lot now, like Shovel Knight Shantae, they don't really have that worldwide audience exactly. that that was it would my take. biggest thing with them. They're, they're very new, mm -hmm. so you can't really put them above characters. Well, well Shantae's not new, but she she's been in the she's, been she's less in the public eye than she was before. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's, that's true. That's fair to yeah. say. Yeah, definitely. Um, maybe the polls that we've been seeing a lot of, maybe the, just the online presence is what's maybe bolstering those numbers up to be what they yeah. bigger than what they actually are. Um, and it made a lot of sense when I thought about it that way. I mean, something that I didn't really think before because, you know, I would look at every single poll that was done online, Reddit, even my own, and be like, oh, okay, Shovel Knight, Shantae, they ain't gonna win this yeah. bitch, you know. The thing with online but, is it's just, it's not representative of everyone who plays Smash. Like, I have friends who don't keep up with the online thing, and they, they know I do because, like, I have a channel. So they're just like, yeah. oh, yeah, wow, Cloud. But they know Cloud. They have no idea who Shantae oh, or yeah. Shovel Knight is, like, Yeah, no exactly. So, that's that's where it gets tricky for us like to determine if the polls actually mean anything because there's that bias in that like uh, what's it called the, yeah you're right audience bias or something there's an automatic bias in general just as soon as the poll went up you know this is online poll only it's not like they're sending these shits to people's houses and they you know <laughs> filling out vouchers yeah. and shit you know it's not on milk cartons you know the <laughs> smash ballot like no it, it, it's, it's an online thing and a lot of people who play these games really don't have an online presence. Yeah. I mean, my, my girlfriend tells me that people who come to GameStop to buy items there, she tells them, well, you can you can get it cheaper on Amazon if you can't find it in GameStop. And they're always like, oh, I don't want to shop online. Isn't that dangerous? And it's like, uh, at this point, it's 2015, what the fuck? man. <laughs> like, dude, <laughs> online is... You can 3D is, print everything. <laughs> see, that's what I'm saying, bro. <laughs> in 2015, you can 3D print shit. But I mean, yeah, it, so it's understandable, that point of view. And now that I, I have that... I'm, I'm surprised I didn't get that medicine dose earlier, but you know me, I, I kind of go off the rails with things. Yeah. So now I'm reconsidering everything. It's so strange. So now when we think of characters that are as iconic or I mean as easily recognizable as those guys that have already been included, Pac-Man, Sonic, yeah. Mario. Like, I don't know Bob, who could be know. more iconic, honestly. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like Master Chief, maybe? Like, But that's just, that's like yeah, out of the realm that, of... That, that, that's reaching into a whole nother spectrum right there, man. Yeah. And then, you know, and then... Of course, a very iconic character would be Steve from Minecraft. I mean, oh, I know that's. No. I know we don't want that. No one wants. Well, I mean, my little some, brother might because he's like yeah, he's exactly. a Minecraft freak. But yeah, <laughs> for the online community, it doesn't seem like we want to see any more Minecraft than there but already we're is. We're not there. the online community is not representative of everyone. So like you, we have no idea like if what we think, and that's very true. If we <laughs> take a look mm. at the melee community, <laughs> at yeah. that hole, that opens a whole other can of worms. That's well. a Pandora's box right yeah, there. Yeah, but th let's not get into that. Anyways. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's very, there's no way to tell. But that's what yeah, I like it, about it, because it builds the hype. Your, your expectations running wild. I'm really excited to see what happens. Yeah, we're we're all we're all a mess right now. There's no one that on this face of the planet right now, you know, unless obviously the Treehouse guys that know what in the fuck is going to be able to be expected. I mean. Two days ago, I was saying Shovel Knight or Shantae or one of those guys for sure. And now, I'm confused as fuck. I don't know what's going on. I mean, King K. Rule to me was always a viable option. Yeah. But I mean, because he hasn't showed up in a, an IP recently, he hasn't shown up in a game or haven't really been on the surface of things on the mainstream for a little while, it makes you wonder what his chances truly are. Um, the same thing was kind of like with Takamaru. Some yeah. different circumstances, of course. But you know, I mean, basically characters that haven't really made an appearance in the public eye and aren't really planned to, um, unlike the big guys that we know of right now, like Cloud and Roy, I mean, excuse me, Ryu. So, yeah. I mean, I don't know, bro. Wait a minute. Hold on. One thing I actually do want to check. Did Nintendo in their Twitter post say that they were only going to explain Cloud or that a new challenger was also approaching? They did. I don't They're think they of... made mention, but I, I can't remember off the top of my head. Oh, okay. I, mean, I, I just want to yeah, yeah. take a look really quick because... Hold on, I'm not going to show all that on camera. We got, we got blocks of that shit, but um, I, I definitely want to take a look because... I don't remember exactly if they said that, you know, oh, we're, we're only going to talk about Cloud or are we going to show details of a new character? Well, I feel like they're definitely going to go into Cloud's moveset in depth, like they did with, like, Mega Man, Rosalina. That happened, mm -hmm. that one big direct, that with all the information in it. Yeah. All at all. Yeah, that, where they, like, really broke down those characters yeah, and showed exactly. all the details. So I feel like they're going to do a similar thing with Cloud, and if we get new characters, them as well. But I feel like stages and other things as well they're going to add, but... It's an open. Oh, okay. It's an. It's, it's an open box. I have no idea. Yeah, it, it's totally impossible to predict at this moment. I mean, any guess that you have in your head right now? I, I don't know. I'm not just talking to you, Alex. Anybody out there? I wouldn't go with it 100 percent anymore, bro. I got it. Tie in with Mar Mario Maker, 8-bit Mario. There you go. Hey, that works, man. That's fine. <laughs> that, that's they, it. They do that's it. it. They fuck with us like that. I, I think Who's so. More I mean, iconic than 8-bit Mario. You can't beat that. Or maybe, maybe Adam is like a palace swap for Mario. I don't know. That would be. In. That's one thing I'm a little bit disappointed about. That we didn't really see too many um, palette additions in Smash Brothers with the DLC yeah, additions. That would be you know, a cool thing. 
I was so hyped for that beforehand. Like, I mean, that was something I was talking about when DLC was still being speculated with the game. Like, ooh, palette swaps. Yeah. You, know, you can get costumes, download them. But I mean, hopefully that comes around. Amazing. But at this point, like, not to beat down a dead horse, but Project M, like, they had, they had some cool costumes that were great ideas for uh, mm -hmm. what Smash could do. And though uh, Smash 4 did do alternate costumes, like, I feel like there's so much more they could do. Yeah, there's so much. They could they could just take advantage of that field and, and, and take it to a whole other level. Yeah, exactly. I feel. And it would add so much freshness to the game. You know, I don't I don't really see an issue with there being too many palace swaps for a character. I mean, it would just add variety and you know make it more fresh of an experience every time. Maybe you play. it's a space thing. Maybe they didn't like put enough space in the game for that. I don't I don't know. I don't think it. They were saving it for the me costumes. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Oh yeah, the thing nobody uses. Yeah, of course, man. Yeah, you know, and just keep adding those Mika. They, people want that more than oh, character yeah. um, palette swaps, right? Yeah. But all right, dude, we got to talk a little bit about them leaks, man. Uh, I, I don't know if leaks are your favorite vegetable. They ain't mine, though, but I mean, hey, <laughs> listen, man. So, and so we already talked about the fact that we don't want this bitch to leak in the slightest. Oh, yeah. We all want to be genuinely surprised. Um, now, there have been some uh, leaks happening today, too. I, um, I you saw probably... your video, but like, I just came inside and I saw the thumbnail. So maybe you could oh. tell me. Oh, no. That one was more of like a fan-made um, trailer where they oh, were kind of... Okay. Um, if, if you played A Link Between Worlds, um, the Zelda game, it was kind of like um, one of the characters from that series. I didn't really play the game myself, so I don't know too much about the character. But um, it, it was kind of like a really cool fan-made trailer. One, like We've seen a lot of those beforehand, yeah. but there's a 4chan thread right now. Um, I don't know if you've seen this yet. I'm going to link you this in the Skype really quick. I want you to take a look with me. And, you know, we'll just go through this. I mean, obviously, let me get you know, it's going to be fake. But, I mean, we can check it out ourselves right now, actually. Let me let me send this to you really quick. All right. Uh, let me see. Let's crack this and, baby open. Yeah, let, let's, let's break this bitch down. And you guys in the, um, you guys in the, well, not in the chat, but you guys that are watching this, I'm going to have this linked in the description as well, too. Um, in case the thread is still up by that time it comes out, so, hey. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's... Uh, how do you even operate this freaking horribly designed website? <laughs> I'm such a design fuck. Like, obviously, it's my series, but, like, it's just like, oh, look at this. That's so ugly, man. <laughs> you. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, let's go through this. Let's break it down, yeah. All right, so... We're seeing a little bit of a, a little bit of that Midgar stage uh, music select, man. Now I'm no, I'm no Final Fantasy person. That's why I was like, mm. you know, Cloud. But I, oh, okay. I don't know if you, you are right. Um, yeah, my girlfriend. She recently got me into it, so ah, I know okay. a bit more than the average, you know, casual. So guy, there's I Midgar. Suppose. Yeah, and then we have some more music lists. There's actually a lot of tracks from a multitude of different Final Fantasy titles. So not just seven. We have um, some 13 going on. Yeah, yeah, a couple other games going on. Mm -hmm. um, and then we got... What is this? We have one remix, apparently. Oh, come on, open. Yeah. Solo. Are you seeing these new Ooh, modes? Adventure new mode? Mode? Ooh, adventure mode? It looks interesting. Bro, Bro I, I know. <laughs> Really? That, that's what you would go for? Oh, that's man. Single player, like, like, oh, really? Okay. Adventure mode for Melee. And SS Melee with, oh, yeah. Melee Adventure mode was awesome. That's so yeah, fun. Definitely. Oh, my God. Oh, please. It was, it was really memorable, dude. Like, I mean. Hold on a second. Let's crack this open. Seems to be a problem here. Like, in the Adventure mode box on the left side of the shape, it's like there's an uneven yeah, portion of it. Yeah, we got some pixel fucked up. Some pixel stuff fuckage. There. Yes. <laughs> It's a professional turn. <laughs> yes, indeed. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah. So, I mean, of course, obviously, we're looking at this with a skeptic's eye big time. But, I mean, it adds some interesting ideas, interesting possibilities. And I'm mm -hmm. kind of seeing it visualized in this way. is sort of cool. And we have some more pictures of the adventure mode here with um, Villager. Yeah. Adventure mode stages have cutscenes, but those are taken from Smash trailers. Basically, functions like old. Oh, really? Now, mm, I can see that they're lazy. They would, <laughs> they would do the trailers. That would kind of make some sense. Yeah. Okay. It's cr it's viable. Is this a CSS with new characters? Yeah. There's Wolf and so. pa Whoa, Paper Mario. Paper Mario. I know you're a huge fucking Paper Mario advocate, yo. <laughs> <laughs> you just you gotta, gotta hold back, man. You can't, you can't let it overtake you, bro. Oh, man. Okay, the font seems similar. I mean, I mean that's a font you can replicate the font. People have done it. Of course, yeah, multiple times over, man. I mean, we all know this is definitely service level stuff when it comes to uh, yeah, leaks. But I mean, 
Interesting concept. I mean, I know there would be a lot of people that would vouch for Paper Mario. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. And then we have his stage. Well, is this a Paper Mario stage? Yeah, it is a Paper Mario stage. Where's this? Uh, is it this down? is Paper Mario. under the picture of him with a hammer. And is that the music? Yeah. Paper Mario medley. Mega Sparkle. Yo, don't take from that game. Sticker Star is not a game. <laughs> Oh, it's oh, Lord. They, they have the Thousand Year Door stuff. And, oh, this looks like the... Oh, this was in 3DS. Or, unless this is the 3DS that it's being shown on. Hmm. No, I, wait, is it? No, I don't think so. The 3DS does have a Paper Mario stage. But I, this oh. looks Wii U. Yeah. It's, a, it's definitely oh, yeah, a Sticker Star stage, though. Hmm. Let me see. Is there anything else in here? There's something below. Sector Z from... 64? Yeah. Really, now? I can see them doing that. That ah, that would make sense. I was think we didn't talk about stages either, but uh, that was one of my ideas. They would act definitely add in retro stage. Yeah, man. I mean, he seemed like he was pretty damn intent on adding those in. Yeah, and there it's not like it's oh my god, it's not like they're too hard to do. Yeah, just bring him back. He literally does nothing to them. So I mean, hey, why not? What is this? Oh, a Xenoblade stage or is it the same one? No, this looks like a new oh, Xenoblade Chronicle X stage. Oh, yeah, you've been playing the too. hell out of that. Oh, dude. Oh, I've been losing my mind in that game. It is so deep. Yeah, that's what like, my friend needed. was playing it. It looks sick, but I'm like, yo, I'll, I'll get nothing done. <laughs> oh, shit. Yo, seriously, we got Black Tar. And, okay, so we got a couple of cool tracks in here, apparently. I would love if Xenoblade Chronicles X stage made an appearance. We have the, the regular melody that shows up in the um, Guar playing stage. We have Primordia. So this definitely looks like, you know, it's believable. It looks so believable. Like, you know, I mean, we've seen leaks similar. Like, I saw somebody yeah. make one of Shrek Swamp, but I mean... Yeah, they're definitely makeable. Like, trust me, I do, like, I'm pretty, like, versed in how to use Photoshop and Illustrator and just, like, programs like this. And it's doable yeah. to make fake ones. So, like, remember the Rayman leak and uh, Artsy Omni. Can't forget that. So people are definitely talented on the internet. So you shouldn't just... This isn't 2008 anymore. <laughs> Hell no. Things have really changed from back then, dude. Like, god damn. You, you can make oh. something look so fucking official. And the last one, Wolf in Battle. This is oh, where Lord. we can determine a few things. Oh, Lord. I mean, it looks believable. He has the same colors. Stock icon looks right. It's probably easy to... Tr it would have been easy to change it with Falco, but... Ew. Damn. It looks solid. You can tell whoever the hell made this put a lot of goddamn work into yeah, it. Yeah, for sure. And let's not forget the possibility of hacking, but I don't know how... I don't think it's that good yet. I know movement yeah. swaps a thing. Model swaps aren't really... No. I don't think it's there yet. Either. Yeah. The biggest model swap I think they I've been able to see is, like, they put Crom's model yeah. on top of Mars, and even then, it looked fucking But there's insane. no model of Wolf in the game, so that would have to be exported externally if someone wants to do that, but... Yeah. I don't know, this... <laughs> I see you in the 4chan thread. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Again, two Eticas. <laughs> what the fuck? How many These Etika niggas reactions can we get? A three! <laughs> Jesus Christ, come on. I think that's it. The Wolf All image right. is the last one. Oh, four. Christ. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hey, man, Xenoblade Chronicles X is a great game, though. We, we have amazing imagery. Like, uh, I saw some some images of Elma in there. Hey, hey, Elma, what you doing? <laughs> Xenoblade <laughs> Hey. Goodness gracious. Goddamn. Elma, what's going on, girl? <laughs> Yo, I got to play that game. After, after we play, after, after we're done with this, I'm, I'm playing me some Xenoblade, bro. Oh, shit. Oh, but yeah, okay, so it seems like that's basically it. So, I mean, I mean, yeah, we, I, take this I, with a grain of salt, guys. Like, once people hop onto this, like the Smashboards threads or people on Twitter, they, they yeah. can tear these apart, find things you can't really see. But, like, I remember there was the Politana leak, and I it was like a similar thing where she was on Battlefield. <laughs> yeah. And I made that, I made an image about it, like comparing, like, yeah, this looks pretty real. I don't know if it was ever real, but it, I mean. No, it turned out to be real. Yeah, exactly. She's in the game, but, like. Dude, I remember, I remember that that era where you were just like breaking everything down, and man, like y your logic was just it, it was so on point a lot of the time, and even even times where I got fooled, you didn't get fooled by the Rayman. No, man, I was like, it. okay, he has the same image for every screen. I'm not buying it. I only Yo, have to make seriously. one render. You can't trick me, That's it. Omni. Get out of here. You can't trick me. I gotta. Yo, man, <laughs> that was fucking hilarious, dude. Yo, you can't get a lax, man. You, you can't catch this man slipping, man. Well, this this leak looks. 
I don't know. I don't know. People are creative, it, but at the same time, this looks very closed. Wolf Yo, it good. brings up an awesome. It brings up an awesome idea of adventure mode making a return. It wouldn't. I mean, we're not game designers, so we can't speak on Sakurai's behalf. Yeah. But I mean, I would. I would consider an adventure mode not being as difficult to program as something really big like subspace yeah for exactly instance, you know? if you recite if you're not making a lot of new stages then for sure depends on what you yeah. mean by adventure mode right yeah exactly so we don't know i if this leak was real i would be happy as hell it, ser yo seriously man like i mean it doesn't really add anything too um debatable in terms of what people would like i mean paper mario overall a lot of people like that series so i mean i, I think this could overall work if this was and plus adding in xenoblade chronicles yeah. x stuff it, it would make a lot of yeah, sense. The game is doing out. extremely well, by the way. You is know, it really? like the scores are the scores have been through the roof That's with good. the game. Like everyone's loving it. I mean, I was a little bit concerned as to how well it would go here in the United States and Western yeah, territories. Yeah, that was my but, I mean, thing with it. But I'm glad. But it's it doing did well. really well. Yeah, I'm. I'm, it, dude. Once you, I know it looks a little bit hard to catch on to when you're watching the gameplay oh, yeah. and maybe even watching the gameplay it looks a little kind of like yeah, that's my thing sometimes. with those art like rpg like they look so complicated i'm like yo mm. oh my god yeah but it's, it's a lot but yo man if you get your hands on that then good luck. i lower. probably would i just got woolly world but anyway <laughs> off, yeah this leak the only reason i think it couldn't be real is just it's paper mario he's 2d he's probably very easy to make a fake render of and wolf he's already in brawl and there's a lot of brawl hacking, so just finding and you can like take it. You can do brawl and take like a green screen of it and put it anywhere. So that's my only yeah. thing for thinking that this it was just fabricated. No, it makes sense. And plus, we've seen Sakurai with um, Roy's return. He kind of revamped his model exactly. a little bit. Um, I don't think Wolf would come in looking exactly like he did from brawl. Yeah, like, because I Falco really and Fox they looked they looked much furrier, and yeah. you could definitely tell. This image is blurry, obviously. So. Yeah, and it, and it kind of looks a little bit too reminiscent of the previous models of Wolf that we've seen. I, yeah. I, I'm not buying. I don't think Sakura would bring him in. Just roll, okay, bro. Yeah, Ryu, that's this it. looks too. This looks too good to be true, or not even good yeah. to be true. It just looks too believable. It's too. It's too easy. It's too safe. Yeah, that's it. And that's one. Of, isn't that one of the things that made the the um the four chan leak that happened in the summertime? Isn't that one of the things that made it seem a little bit out there that this didn't exactly play safe? Like when they when you saw the duck hunt render yeah, and whatnot. Yeah, that like, was it one was of like, the things. Um, it's not the job of like uh, Sakurai and his team to make us believe it. It's the leakers. They want you to believe it, so they're gonna try and make you believe it with believable stuff. Sakurai he doesn't have to try. It's his game. He's like, oh, I'm gonna put this in. If you don't believe it, yeah. it's in there. So whatever. I mean, and there were so many people in denial. But yeah. one point that I remember you pointed out is that the leak it had actually followed the format of a glitch that people saw in the 3DS version earlier with the line thickness between oh, yeah, the character that was portraits a big being thing. there. And it was just that, like, yeah, it follows through with the glitch. It's like actually, this isn't. This actually proves it because of that. But yo, I can't take oh, the credit. That goodness. was like Smash Boards helped out with that. I can't take the credit for that. No, I saw the thread, man. Like that thread went so in with all these details, man. It, it was insane. Yeah. I mean, and you know, big props to you as well for you know actually bringing that information to the forefront. Yeah. You know, back then, a lot of the time, like my videos were like the hype, but alas, he had the breakdown, right. man. So I mean, like it, it was just like so crazy to see all that information coming through, and I mean, yo. It, it was on top. It was, it, was, it was on top of everything, bro. Like, that, that news, when it came out, man, I remember everyone was talking about that shit for fucking weeks, yeah, bro. that was, was like, insane. Oh, man. I can't believe it still. Like, Smash has never had a leak like that. That was, in, that's insane. Yeah, it's ridiculous, man. I mean, and it was so much buildup because, I mean, I remember that, you know, the leaks that had happened earlier, I don't really remember them specifically by name, yeah. but people had been seeing reputable sources posting about these characters being in. Like, I remember yeah. Bowser Jr. Oh, was talked God. about for was, months before. There was, like, um, there's, I guess you can watch the video. I don't want to go into it all this, but there was, yeah. like, people yeah. who were inside, and they sent uh, alternate costumes of Bowser and Mario that were made in Brawl, but they weren't to show that those were in... They were just like, okay, this is what it's going to look like. And then this was a few days before E3. So then at E3, these costumes were shown at the tournament, and it was just like, oh shit, oh shit. Yeah, okay. And they came we're, forward we're, with it's... other leaks, and no one's like, I don't believe it. And then, um, it's called like the Ninka Van Rose, Van Van Rose leak. Yeah, Van Ross, Van Rose. I don't know how to say it, but. But um, yeah, it was. They were shown, or someone told to him. I'm getting so confused, but he was said like Robin is going to be shown, and Robin was shown. It's like, oh, <laughs> oh shit, it's uh -oh. not Krom. <laughs> Jamatsu's dead, and the whole thing with that is everyone yeah. believed Jamatsu. Because they said Krom. Yeah. So. And, and then Krom just, I, I maybe it's plausible that Krom was going to be in, but he wasn't. I think that is something Sakurai said that he was going to put him in, but he was just too much the same to Marth. 
But then mm. Roy's there. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I would love to see Krom make an appearance um, in two days. Like, I wouldn't be mad at that. Yeah, me and, neither. And considering all the teasing that Sakurai's been doing with Krom, and that's one thing. Daddy Sakurai knows how to tease, man. Oh. This man knows how to fucking just, just play games. He knows how to fuck with our minds, make us think one thing, and he has, actually does a, something totally different. And it's like... If Krom made an appearance suddenly where it's like, actually, I am going to be in the game. Like, that would make so much sense. <laughs> yeah. um, I don't know if you've seen Palutena's guidance, the discussion that they have um, with Robin, where Krom comes through and he's, like, actually interacting with them and they're joking on him on oh, not being in the game. Yeah. It's pretty hilarious. And uh, it would just make so much sense. Krom appears everywhere in this bitch. And for him to show up, That would be funny playable? and unexpected. I know he is a fan of doing the unexpected. And yes. I think he will. Yeah, that's my whole thing so is going to surprise and blow our expectations like I know it's not good to keep your expectations high but I think he yeah. will just because it's Sakurai it's, yeah. this is the final that, the final thing this might be his final game You don't, like where could they go from this like they're not going to make another Smash game with all these characters like at least I don't think this is like the, think so. the top this is this is the best Smash game you could have one of the probably one of the best games ever made in my opinion yeah, <laughs> I mean, roster, god damn say best roster so people yeah. don't like oh best they yeah, oh yeah. my god Oh, oh yeah, of course. We can't forget that. <laughs> Thank goodness gracious. But, you know, but yo, LX, thank you for coming through with me no on this, problem. man. It's been yo, a pleasure as always. You don't know how many people were telling me, you got to get my boy LX. And I'm like, what the hell do you think? I'm not going to get my boy here? Like, what the hell do you think this is? As hell. Thank you for having me, man. It's always fun. No. No, are you going to be like, are you not going to be working on Tuesday? So you'll be able to watch it when no, it happens I'm, live? No, I'm going to be working on like videos. That's all I'm doing right now. I'm out of school, but... I, I don't know if I'm going to stream because my streaming shit, but... Oh, shit. Maybe, oh, no, no, no. I, I'm going to be there. I'm going to be on Twitter. I'm going to be hyped. I'll probably make a follow-up video oh, of what yeah. happens. So, mm, if anything, mm. I'm going to be there. Yo, you dudes definitely got to show support to my boy. You know, considering he's out of school now, he's doing these, this YouTube thing. He's doing his thing on social media. He's doing his thing on Twitch as well, too. I'll leave links to all this man on um, the description of this video. So, go and check him out. He's got amazing content. And if you want a really in-depth comical on top of everything else um look at some of the characters in detail you can check out his know your moves series um and he has a lot of great series as well too on top of all that but you got to check my boy out know your moves is the, the cream of the crop don't even don't even fade that's, i that's mean i know you got i know you got a that's lot my of great stuff to do, and <laughs> oh really oh okay yeah, stay tuned this week it's coming out the next one the christmas episode don't miss it for anything at all hey let's go <laughs> man so you got two days left until the goddamn final announcement after the direct just saying, oh, okay. Just to, yeah. To curb the just, hype. I hear you, yeah. dude. Bill, thanks once again, man. Oh, I'm, I'm going to hit you up, man. We got to stay in touch. We got we to gotta work on something like complex together oh. at some point, dude. We got we to work on something, man. We'll, we'll figure it out. I know your moves in the future, maybe, you know. Hey, I'll, I'll show up. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hype, man. <laughs> <laughs> let's go. <laughs> All right, dude. I'll talk to you. Yo, let's go, man. All right, man. Peace. Take it easy. And guys, that was my boy, Relax Relax, in the goddamn building, man. Two days, man. Are you ready? Because I damn sure ain't. I'll talk to you in the next video. Take care of yourselves. And of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.